So, Bob is uh, taking off a dressing that they put on my blister last night. Because it was uh, really bad yesterday after the skin came off. They treated it all day, continued to get more infected. So they went, uh, we have antibiotics. And we're just trying to uh, see if we can get going today. We want to get it going today. It's looking better. It does look better, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the team is going to, uh, this is what's so great about having a good support team. The guys are going to try to work on it this morning. We're going to try and uh, get up and running, no pun intended, again today. As you know, we got less than 10K yesterday. We've been doing managing 70K days, which physically, I feel no problem. I feel great. I feel absolutely fantastic physically, and my legs are willing to put in even more miles per day to get across the desert. Uh, I've become accustomed to the backpack, all of this stuff. Um, but uh, something like this just stops you in your tracks, and yesterday the skin came off, or like I completely detached, and have here and Bob had to remove the skin and so now we're just uh, got to get it to a point where I can start running again. We're going to try today and then if it doesn't work today then we're definitely going to start running tomorrow. And well, it's day eight of uh, Atacam Extreme. Another beautiful day in the desert. Check out this crazy dry terrain. It's dry. <laughs> uh, yesterday was a very short day as I'm sure you've already seen from the video. About uh, less than 8k. I uh, had a really bad blister. Still nursing it now. That's why I'm walking and talking as opposed to running and talking and tripping or tearing it open again, the bandages. But um, patched it up. I'm at about 20k right now and uh, so far so good. Don't want to jinx it. And uh, just trying to find the best train I can. Been still following along uh, through the railroad tracks that had cut through that dry lake bed. Lost the trail, but found the tracks again, which are sort of half uncovered and then, and then half covered. But it gives me a great gauge to follow. And I'm going to see the support team today, every 25 or so, okay, just to be safe. But, uh, a beautiful day today in the desert and for students and teachers thank you so much the other day for that amazing video conference and we can't wait to connect with you guys this week um, we got some neat stuff to cover uh, Adriana's working on some of the topics and of course Matt which I know all of the teachers have been in touch with is really excited for the next uh, video conference as well so uh, yeah, all in all, things to look forward to and keep you moving forward even if you do have a blister or two.